How do Maltese say sorry? Maltese express remorse and try to apologize with physical signs, such as hanging their heads and tucking their tail between the legs. There is a lot to know about this apologetic behavior in Maltese, which reveals the nature of communication in Maltese eyes. That's why. In this video, we will share 15 common ways your Maltese apologizes to you. Number 1. Licking Once your Maltese realizes they have crossed the line, the immediate need to lick you as their apology may begin. Nuzzling next to your neck and licking it is their ultimate mess-up apology that may leave you not only stunned, but also help you forget all about the mistake that caused chaos. Number 2. Avoiding Eye Contact Maltese may show their apologetic nature with their big sympathetic eyes. Others may avoid eye contact when reprimanded. Avoiding eye contact can also be a sign of apologizing for their trouble. In addition, the lack of eye contact with a coward head could make you reconsider being angry at them and help your Maltese become more aware of when they have crossed the line. Number 3. Whimpering Depending on the amount of trouble caused or damage done, your Maltese may express guilt for its wrongdoing. They may feel so guilty that a whimper of worry will come. If your Maltese begins to feel guilty about their wrongdoing, they could rub against your legs while getting into your space and letting out a whimper. Number 4. Hiding their face If your Maltese has destroyed something beyond repair or caused some other type of problem in your home, then the frustration and disappointment that follows may cause them to hide their face in their paws. Number 5. Tail Tucking Another way that Maltese may apologize is by tucking their tails between their legs. This behavior is a sign of submission and can be seen as a way for dogs to show that they are sorry for their actions. When a Maltese tucks its tail, it may also lower its head and avoid eye contact to show that it is not a threat. Number 6. Looking at you with sad eyes. This often signifies that your pup feels guilty and wants to apologize. An apologetic look from your pup typically consists of a lowered head or averted gaze, droopy ears, and an overall dejected expression. This silent apology is one of the most common ways for dogs to express their regret, especially because they understand that humans are more likely to empathize with them when they appear unhappy. Number 7. Bringing you their favorite toy. This is another way for Maltese to apologize for misbehaving. Even though this behavior may seem counterintuitive, it's actually quite thoughtful and shows that your pup genuinely wants to make amends. This gesture typically involves the dog bringing its favorite toy or object up to its owner in an effort to be forgiven or gain approval. Number 8. Sitting down on the owner's foot. When a Maltese senses that his owner does not adore him as usual, the pooch would try his level best to stay close to him. You would see that your pet is sitting down on your foot. Apart from this, your Maltese will also try to sit on your lap and even lick your feet. These actions of your pet are nothing less than an adorable way of him apologizing to you. Number 9. Sleeping in the same room as you. It's an expression of trust and loyalty, displaying that the pup recognizes its owner's authority and wants to remain close despite any mistakes it has committed. This behavior not only conveys remorse, but also serves as a form of comfort for both parties. By curling up near its owner, the pup is reassured of its guardianship and can find solace in their companionship. Number 10. Whining or barking softly. This behavior communicates regret and understanding, as well as a desire for reconciliation. By making these quiet sounds, the pup is trying to show its owner that it understands it has done something wrong and that it wants to be forgiven. Furthermore, this action also expresses a certain level of trust. By being willing to make such vulnerable noises, our furry friends demonstrate that they feel safe enough in their environment to express their remorse honestly and openly. Number 11. Pawing Maltese body language can say a lot about its feelings, and pawing when dogs say sorry is one way to communicate. Unlike humans, dogs cannot express regret verbally. They express their feelings by pawing at us and using nonverbal means. In some cases, dogs growl or rip up items in our home to express their emotions. Some dogs also paw in an attempt to win our affection or get rewards. Number 12. Jumping up. When dogs attempt to interact with us, they may jump up if they want attention or are really excited. While this can be frustrating for pet owners at times, it's important to remember that your Maltese is likely attempting to apologize for something. 
Dogs usually jump up when they think their behavior has caused a problem in the relationship, even if you don't think it's necessary. The behavior can start as puppies when parents scold them for being naughty and may persist into adulthood if not handled correctly. Number 13. Lying down in front of you. One of the most demonstrative kinds of Maltese communication is the act of lying down in front of their owners an apology of sorts. This behavior is a sign of remorse and indicates that they are embarrassed by their actions. Number 14. Rubbing the muzzle over the owner's face and neck. Your pet would rub his muzzle over your neck and face to show his affection and love towards you. It is generally done when a Maltese notices that his owner is angry or not paying enough attention to him. Maltese are quite intelligent and can figure out if their owners are not happy with them. Number 15. Seeking Constant Attention Maltese like to seek oodles of love and attention from their owners. When a Maltese realizes that he has done something wrong, he would try to persuade his owner. Due to this, these furry pals would follow their owners as much as they can. When their favorite human gets angry with them, pets would try to remain in their sight to seek affection. Number 16. Sitting next to you quietly. Not only does this behavior demonstrate that the pup knows it has done something wrong, but it also signals that it wants to make amends. Additionally, this action displays a level of trust and loyalty between humans and canines. When a pup sits peacefully next to its caretaker, it shows that it trusts them as an authority figure and is willing to accept whatever punishment or discipline may come its way. Number 17. Seeking Forgiveness Finally, some dogs may apologize by seeking forgiveness from their owners. Maltese may do this by approaching their owners with a submissive posture or by offering their paw for a shake. Dogs may seek forgiveness as a way to show that they are sorry and to ask for their owner's approval. If your Maltese seeks forgiveness after misbehaving, it's important to acknowledge their behavior and to let them know that you forgive them. You can do this by speaking to them in a calm and reassuring tone and petting them gently. In conclusion, Maltese may apologize in several different ways, including licking, tail tucking, bringing gifts, whining, making eye contact, sighing, avoiding eye contact, offering affection, changing behavior, and seeking forgiveness. Understanding these behaviors can help you communicate better with your dog and strengthen your bond with them.